Ladies and gentlemen, up next is our main event. It's not over yet. Our main event is also a title fight for the Dragon House Heavyweight Belt. These two fighters weighed 265 pounds each. In the blue corner, Van Povey. Ladies and gentlemen, the moment we have all been waiting for. Up next, the Dragon House 30 main event of the evening. Challenger for the heavyweight belt, Eduardo Perez. Official introduction here is John Rayboy. Welcome to the main event. Once again, this is a heavyweight championship fight. The winner of this fight will become the first Dragon House heavyweight champion. First up in the blue corner, he has a professional record of one and one. I'm going to announce the fighters. We are waiting for the doctors. I'm going to announce the fighters now, but there may be a delay while the doctors return. So first up, in the blue corner, once again, he's one and one as a professional. He's 27 years old, fights for Gorilla Jiu-Jitsu out of Pleasanton, California. He is Van the General. His opponent, 24 years old, fights for AKA in San Jose out of Berkeley, California. He is undefeated as a pro, the record of one win and no losses. He is Eduardo the Boogeyman Perez. Ladies and gentlemen, uh, due to the uh, medical complications of the co-main event of the evening, we're still waiting for the paramedics to be ready. I believe our paramedics were taking our co-main event loser to the hospital due to a uh, leg injury. So Igor Pontes is being taken care of by our, uh, our great and awesome medical staff. They will be back very shortly, but legally in the state of California under the California State Athletic Commission. This fight is not allowed to continue unless we have medical staff, doctors, and paramedics on site. So both of our fighters are in the cage, but this fight cannot continue until our medical staff is on site. Okay, we've done this before. Briefly, once again, ladies and gentlemen, in the blue corner, fighting for Gorilla Jiu-Jitsu out of Pleasanton with a record of one and one, the General Van Povey. In the red corner, one and oh, is a pro fighting for AKA out of San Jose via Berkeley, Eduardo the Boogeyman Perez. The winner will be the first Dragon House heavyweight champion. Your referee for this fight is Josh Rosenthal. Josh Rosenthal, our referee for our main event of the evening here at Dragon House 30, brought to you 
by NorCal Fight Shop. Bomb first, made possible by BrightPathVideo.com and of course our official photos taken by the one and only OJ Castro of MMARaw.org. And it all comes down to this. Who will become the next Dragon House MMA Heavyweight Champion? Eduardo Perez and Van Povey. These two gentlemen are a collective 12 feet tall, weighing over 500 pounds. Of course, our referee, Josh Rosenthal, the UFC veteran referee. Big overhand right, right away. And Perez looking for a takedown. The boogeyman ends up on top. Look in the frame of a triangle here is Povey. And it looks like that triangle is almost locked in. And you know what? The six foot five, 265 pound Perez laying down some relentless grounded pound. I'll tell you what, Tusi, everyone's brains are the same size. That is why heavyweight fights almost always end in a knockout. Because oh, yeah. these guys hit hard, but you know what? A, a heavyweight six foot five, 265 pound fighter's brain is the same size as a five foot three, 125 pound flyweight. It's Absolutely. just a matter of force behind their punches that's being impacted on their brain. Yeah, definitely. These I agree. guys are heavy hitters. And you know, you hear the term baddest man on the planet tossed around a lot. So if these guys are able to secure the belt, the most coveted championship belt in all of California, all of the West Coast, are these guys in the running to be considered baddest man on the planet? I say yes. Yeah. Perez dropping Kobe back down to the mat. So far delivering some vicious ground and pound here. Perez looking to maybe take the back. Perez looking to get those hooks in. He's got one, he's got two. Perez looking for a rear naked choke. And you know what, how often do we see heavyweight title fights end in a Perez submission? Perez got to be, oh, look in the frame of arm bar here. Come out the back nice door. Transition. Oh, nice arm bar by Perez, but it's not at the proper angle. And now Povey ends up on top. Perez is able to close that guard. Perez is not in the worst position, but he could definitely be in a better position here. Oh, delivering some vicious ground and pound here of his own is uh, Van Povey. And Perez kicks like him off. I like the way Perez gets up there, and now they're looking to slug it out. Perez says, let's go. Kobe says, okay. Leg kick just misses. Perez taunting his opponent. Perez starting to look a lot more comfortable than his opponent in there. But because of oh, the nice overhand rounds, right. there's less than five seconds to go here in round number one. Nice stiff jab lap there by Povey. Round number one comes to a close. And referee Josh Rosenthal does a nice job stopping the action there. Round number two is officially underway between Eduardo Perez and Van Povey. Right, you know what, not much to say about these guys other than the fact that they are huge, they hit heavy, and they can grapple considering Absolutely. how big they are. This heavyweight main event brought to you by NorCal Fight Shop, Bomb First, Execute Shield, MMA Raw, the official photographer of Dragon House MMA, and of course made possible by brightpathvideo.com. And with that being said, for all your streaming needs, both video and audio, you can contact John Perulis. Oh, nice overhand right landed by... Oh, oh, by nice Povey. strikes by Van Povey. This fight could go either way, Tusi.
Nice body shot by, by Perez. Oh! Oh! Oh, my God! Highlight reel knockout! Pony is out cold! And Perez is the new Dragon House MMA! Heavyweight champion of the world! What a fight by these two heavyweight fighters. Eduardo Perez knocking out Bam Povey in the second round of our main event at Dragon House 30. What a fight. What a warrior. Hats off to both of these fighters, though. What a great fight by both of these heavyweights. Uh, Bam Povey came in, had a game plan, fell just a little bit short. Eduardo Perez able to capitalize, knocking out Povey in the second round with a beautiful flush punch to the chin. Congratulations to Eduardo Perez. The new Dragon House heavyweight champion. Congratulations to Eduardo Perez. What a fight. Ladies and gentlemen, this main event has been brought to you by ExecuShield, a gold star sponsor for Dragon House for every single one of our shows in the last 12 years. ExecuShield.com for elite, private, corporate, and government security. Who's your boy? Here today I'm with you, the winner, one minute and 11 seconds into round number two via knockout. The Boogeyman, Eduardo Perez. He remains undefeated at 2-0 and, oh and is the new Dragon House Heavyweight Championship belt holder. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with your new heavyweight champion, Eduardo Perez. Now before I ask you anything, everyone who came out here to support Eduardo Perez, let me hear you guys make some noise. Now, Eduardo, first of all, congratulations on the new heavyweight belt. Second of all, please never punch me in the face. Second of all, how do you feel right now? I want to thank God, Coach Hector, and Cormac and everybody who's supporting me. Thank you guys. You feel great. Now, Eduardo, this is one of the most coveted belts in all of California, in all of MMA, the Dragon House belt. And you hear the term, baddest man on the planet, tossed around a lot. Do you think you're the baddest man on the planet, and what's next for you? Anybody can get it. Bring it. Ready. Well, once again, congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, your heavyweight champion, Eduardo Perez. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for coming. This has been Dragon House 30. We'll see you back here at Kizar for Dragon House 31, March 23rd, 2019.